Hey guys, so real quick, I'm gonna go over how to work with your child on doing a couple uh, striking drills, mainly, mainly a little bit of boxing and a little bit of kicking. Now when you do this, I'm assuming that you're at home and you don't have any kind of pads or anything to work with, and I do this sometimes at the school when I teach, I relax my hands and I keep my fingers together. I don't put my fingers out because if, if the child hits your fingers, it can hurt. So I relax my fingers, but I keep them together. I let the child hit the center of my palm, okay? So first two knuckles should hit right in the center. I'm not trying to push too hard back at them, but it's just like a mitt, if I had a mitt. So if here, Tyler, Master Tyler's gonna help me out. He's gonna throw a punch. I'm just gonna lightly, lightly smack that punch. So here, I'm just a little touch, a little touch. Now what you want to avoid is while he's doing this, I don't want to jam his, his, his fingers. You're gonna hurt your kid. What you wanna do is just lightly give like a, almost like a real delicate high five, okay? So here, boom, boom, okay? And my, my fingers are just gonna relax as he hits right on top, okay? So, when you do this with your child, you're gonna be mimicking their stance. One hand's in front, one hand's in back. You're gonna be opposite, one hand in front, one hand in back. And you control the rhythm by counting for them. So the front hand's one, back hand's two. So I say one, hip, and two. Hip, one, hip, and two. Hip, one, hip, and two. Hip, it's very important that the person putting their hands up controls the strikes. If they start tri striking like crazy, both of you are gonna get hurt, okay? So do this drill very, very slowly, all right? So after a while, when they feel comfortable, try and try and work with their coordination so you can go one, hip, one, hip, one, hip, two, hip. Okay, now we're getting into basic boxing drills, all right? Thank you.